Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Live a Live with me, Boulders McGammer. I refined a ton of stuff, but I'm gonna have to refine more later, so I'll go over that later. Right now, I have to defeat this extra set of enemies. I'm gonna take care of this one the same way I have been, but to take care of this one, I'm gonna use this new goldfish shot, which I got from that accessory that I refined five million times. It takes some time to charge up, but it's easily the most powerful ability in this chapter. Taro officially became awesome. Unfortunately, it does take time to charge up, so I'm gonna use this punch to take out this guy. And I'll use this kick to take out this guy. Which should level me up. Okay, I got more power parts. And I got back in one piece. Very easy. Alright, let's see here. Well, for being a pervert, I guess I'll give him a snack, because he's just like me! Have this Taiyaki. Okay, what do you want then? Okay, if you don't want the Taiyaki, do you want this gutsy Taiyaki? He gave me a glove. That's a really bad item. You could refine it into something. Hey, Watanabe. Here, have this snack. Yes, I am aware that somebody cried out. Let's give him this banana crepe. He gave me a cap. Now to go over these items. The cap is the best defensive item in this game at four defense. For the head. Yeah, it's not that great. Oh well. Let's go ahead and use these power parts. Because we can. As for all these other items here, you can get the writer builds by refining items up and up over and over and over again. And since you have that clothesline out there to give you infinite items, you can get infinite writer builds if you want. As for the Shinju shirt, you just refine a writer belt. For this power wrist, I got lucky with Taiko's panties. You can find one of these later in the cha chapter, but Taiko's panties can basically evolve into anything that's useful. And by evolve, I mean be refined into. As for these other kids... What do you want, kids? Do you want this expensive Taiyaki? Oh, a power wrist, okay. Well, I guess that's where the other one was. And it's a Masanga. Which if you didn't get him earlier, which I... is... okay. Oh, it's an accessory, what does that do? Four intelligence, but it also increases your evasions by a lot. So I'm gonna keep that for a while. Which means I have more writer belts to throw onto you! Yay! Oh, that reminds me. I probably have an extra shower cap or something. Nope, I don't. Or he can't wear it. I'm out of stuff! Let's go see what that eek was about. Kenshi, help! Get out of the way! Time to be a hero. Rawr! Kick this shit! Right on! Ugh. We're getting out of here. Let me go! Kazu! Keiichi! Wub! The Crusaders took Kazu! What? Wait for me! Wow, what nice weather! It's a perfect day for a ride. Hey, look where you're going! Sorry about this! Come on, Slowpoke! Well, it's a good thing he wasn't on fire. Squirtle wouldn't have been able to save that. Now for this thing. 
I hate this. Because I never know what I'm doing here. Anyway, let's just keep on going around until I get the thing to happen. Anyway, just keep on going the direction that they left the screen. Clara. And eventually you'll go the right way. I'm not gonna voice that every single time. Music here is kinda creepy too. I like how they just suddenly appear as if there was actual line of sight in this game. Eventually though, they will go down here. And that's when you'll know you'll have one. Gotcha. Y you You're always getting in our way. I'll kill you. Anyway, this fight's just as easy as the first fight that you had in the game. Now well, let's see here. Go fish shot. I'll take down that guy way down there. Easy. This may or may not handle everything else. Oh, I guess it didn't. Time for Pissed Fest! Right on! Alright! Well, why is this kidnapping, folks? I ain't talking. Get crap! I have to take 2,000 people to the facility to a commander. Couldn't be. Matsu is awesome! The army, and the, the army and the research facility. Matsu. Should I go to the facility? I'm going over. Wait! I guess we should follow after them. I mean, those crusaders aren't moving. Eh, uh, it looks like everything's back to normal. Which I guess is good. Can you still get items here? Yes, you can. But now is a good time for you to start leveling up. Wow, look at all these things! Alright, uh, nope, not that one. Not that one. Here we go. This should take out most of them. Now I should just punch these things up here. And here goes Mother Image. This should take out all these remote controlled cars. Oh shoot. It didn't hit two of them. That's scary, actually. That's very scary. Punch this one that's trying to close in. Shoot. Okay. That was close. They almost exploded on me. Vulture shot missed. Ah, that's nasty. Why would somebody do something like that? That's horrible. But yeah, as you can see, that's a good fight for you to get lots of power parts. Of course, the item drop rate is pretty low, but it's still enough to get some power parts. You could easily get his health up to like 500 this chapter. And you think, he didn't even level up once. But this is just gonna keep happening. So just keep on using Mother Image and take out all this other stuff to your leisure. I should probably cut all this out. Well, that was good. Hmm, 
If only I had something that attacked vertically. So I'll just sit here and cover the areas I can't reach. Good. Aha. Yes. Mother image will miss, but who cares? I killed all those. All for upgrade parts. Why is he drinking beer? He's about to get kicked in the face, that's why. Yeah, I should demonstrate this. Notice that the run option has been replaced with a teleport option. Hey, an abnormal pearl. What this will do is, instead of having you come out of battle being right where you just were... You'll come out in a random place, like on the toilet. You never know where you're gonna come out. Alright, so... I'm going to grind up on a lot of these guys. Actually, how close am I to leveling? Right, it's the equip menu. I'm like one battle away from leveling, and then I can show the next battle. So you're gonna have to bear with me on one more of these stupid fights. Taro Punch, here. Oh, you just love seeing all that destruction? Move to the side. All right, I think I got it. I should probably use some of the other abilities, so I don't have all the good abilities yet. I keep forgetting whether it's punch or kick that goes into a plus or cross shape. I keep finding those abnormal pearls. But yeah, now I'll fight something different. Those things! And now I can use Hell Image, which is a lot more powerful. I can also use this Goldfish Shot, which I can use to cover prayer. That was actually a lot less effective than I thought it would be. Hey, but these random battles will keep on changing up until you get to about level 13. So I'm gonna keep on using this Hell Image, and I'm gonna keep on using this Goldfish Shot. With this, I'll probably end up killing everything. Never mind. Random damage is random. Ah. That's why I don't like Hell Image that much. It's just a bit too random for my taste. I much prefer Sleet Image. Either way, I do need to get at least one more Napalm Bomb, which will let me get that Power Spark ability. Once I have Power Spark, these fights will be a breeze! Ah, that was horrible. I thought that ability was supposed to be reliable. Well, I've always had it be fairly reliable for me. But no matter. Next time, I'll let's play Live a Live with me, Voltage McGammer. Oh, I've refined everything! Ah. Later, Psychics! It all starts where we began. Right. Over. Here.